Hey guys, Grassman here, play more Clash Royale. Mm, don't think I want the fireballs. Okay, so we got these things to do. And then we'll do more normal battles. Hang on a moment. Okay. Um... So, I guess let's go okay, my defense is already up, but it looks like they all it looks like our boat got destroyed. Oh, that one's shielded. Oh, and the two of the other ones have been destroyed. It's only got four left. Don't need to fight them though, they're so low. Where are they? They're down at that. So the two behind us, the main ones, so MLG has been knocked, and they're they're shielded right now. So did we both get knocked and have to repair? Maybe. So that's oh so there's another so I guess there's another thing. Once you repair, you can you can redo your defense. Um, let's see. Don't really care. Okay, I guess let's do a duel. Um, expo deck to start. use my main deck. I... Uh, boo! Look at that, she's not even doing any damage, jeez. Oh my god. My cards are so under- he used my- I should have assumed he would use his main deck. He used his main deck, so all his cards are level 13, mine are only like level 11s. It's really hard to win when you're fighting with such underleveled cards. Look at that, the Valkyrie's doing like no damage. And the Goblin is doing so much. My towers are what's doing most of the damage there. It's so unfair. God. Look at that, even with all my guys on it, I still couldn't stop the giant. Musketeer should do more than like half the minion's health. So I've got two more decks. 
I'll use this one next. I'd rather, not, I'd rather not lose my really good one. So I'll use this one, and then I'll use the first one next if I have to. Got a level 13 giant skeleton. Ugh. Okay, see that though, that's a lower level. Don't, don't oh, remember that dude. I'm gonna wait with the infant tower. Because he's putting a dark prince in front. Again. What? What was that? That's garbage. God. Game, can I get someone who's actually as actually like my skill level? Or my card level, I mean? He probably is my skill level. I could beat him had I if I had stronger cards. He is my skill level. Can I get someone who's my card level, please? So that I could actually have a chance at winning. Ignore the right tower mostly. Except when I can. Thank you, game, for not giving me anyone who has my card level. Both his decks were higher level than mine. Can't even see. Can I? Yeah. So I had level average of 11 with... I have an average of 11 and an average of slightly... A, a slightly under 11 and slightly over 11. He had a 13 and a 13 with two 11s. So he had a 13 and a slightly under 13. That's fair game. Huh. Who was I even fighting? Some random guy. Okay, um, have a giant deck. The shield will expire at some point, so I'll be able to use the balloon to attack. Can those things hit balloon? The Gatling guns? That could be a good strategy, but it's okay. Just get them to focus on something and then to go in balloons. Because if your opponent forgets air defense. Um, great.
nail on this button. See, why didn't the wizard shoot there? She would've, he would've caught the, um... Sometimes the cars are a bit stupid. Like, the tower is gonna shoot and finish off a guy so the wizard doesn't shoot, but then ends up not killing a bunch of other ones. Oh, some... People move there or something? Okay, I'm gonna save my other attack, so we'll just do some 1v1s. For once, I actually have the advantage. I almost never do unless I'm playing a level 11. This guy's cards are low level though. What, how did that manage to lock on the wizard? I didn't see Gollum coming. Oh, he ended up missing with my wizard. He missed my wizard. Wow, and they actually managed to get the three crown in like the ten seconds there. The towers can be destroyed so fast when the other guy's not fighting. Oh right, and that I thought that was just a 1v1. No, that was the actual battle. That was important. I very rarely get actually actually get two crowns in my warring like that. Let me see if I can. Wins 2518. Three crowns 1196. And most of those three crown wins were from but most of those were from before when I was in the lower arenas, or when I get or when I get a tiebreaker. Um, does it not say two crowns? I guess not. How many battles have I played though compared to my wins? That's what I want to know. Current favorite favorite card: Royal Giant. Not necessarily. I like Mini Pekka. I think my favorite card is probably Mini Pekka, or the Firecracker. 
Hi, Mini Pekka. That's only another level 12. And again, he didn't talk. If I say good... Good luck to you, say good luck back. You only have bad luck? I know, it was a mess. See, he would have shot there, that one fire spirit wouldn't have hit. I, I, I don't, I hate when I do that. <laughs> First guy just died in the explosion. Why is he going Royal Giant Hog? Who does Royal Giant Hog? Must have taken four guys for him to kill my firecrack now. So for a level 12 to kill a level 13 firecracker, it takes that, it takes four shots. And what, how long has it been since I upgraded my firecracker? I thought I already had a level 13 for a while. You have to admit, he is fighting pretty well. Can't hold out forever, though. Hey, okay, dude, just end it. He was really close to strapping on the cannon there. Now that it's the end of the season, all like the higher level, nor most of the people around my my skill level are higher up. So I end up fighting a bunch of weaker guys, so it's just easier to move up. It's kind of unfair, but... This guy's level 12 and he's only in the Silver League. Yes, and he's got his voice thing on. He's got the, the chat. It's, there's nothing bad about having a chat on, unless you find a, another jerk. Oh god. Um... Cycle? Is it Cycle? Yes. Well, oh wow, so the tower takes... So one level below takes four shots. So if I ever run into level 11 again, it could take like five shots to kill it. The four shots isn't actually enough to get an extra shot off usually.
one hog survives. I only got 26 trophies, wow, that's not much. Normally, normally you get like 28 to 32. Level 11. Wow, two four costs to stop a nine cost push. Plus I already put I already put him here. He's probably gonna be in San Aquarium later. He missed. Yeah, it'll probably be in San Aquarium later. I haven't played that in a few days. He's actually got really high level cards to be a level eleven, meaning he must have like all his other cards are like really low level, like extremely low level, because even me, I've got, n I don't have m many cards above level 11, unless they're the ones I use. But I have most things at level 11. For him to have a deck at level 12 and levels 12 and 13, but to still only be level 11, I have most of my stuff. I have most of my stuff at level 11, or or level 13 if I use it. And I'm a level 13, or mid level 12. So that's what I was at mid level 12. But now, but this guy's like. his last time. <laughs> Do you have time for one more? Maybe. Do one more very quick. beat this guy. I just don't know if I can beat him fast enough. Ah, that's so annoying. You did have to spend an extra five there, though. I had to spend an extra, what, three? Four, five for the log. So he must have spent whatever reserves he had of elixir. Oh god. That 
that worked out so well in my favor. I got a ton of damage off. Okay, rush the tower. I think that's gonna be GG. I just have to defend this push. Or possibly one more. I think this, I just have to defend this push, I think. Almost no damage, too. Just a bit of dull and death damage. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. And that Mega Knight hit. And that's it. That did a 600 damage as a jump? That's crazy. I thought it did a lot, so I didn't realize it did that much. Um, e dragon. And... Nine, nine, nine. Okay. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys!